Jamie's blog. Got to get up now. I need to print off my work and oh, also download a copy of the assessment brief and find timetables which I have to hand in my work. Although there's document ones, I may just put them in there. But yeah, um, thank God it's Friday, really. <laughs> my Friday for today, let's see, and we're at ten to one. So what I'm gonna do is just go and take. Uh, what to call it, a tenor out for today then go through this day as quickly as I can because I want to just go in and finish this week because the day week I've been having in uni is it really bothers me so I need to do that and yeah I got my coffee here toast is downstairs so I have to grab that so uh, let's get this day started with shall we I just want to say now for people out there who have um, been watching these recently and seen a lot of negativity of what I've been given, uh, I apologise. It's just these last few days in uni have been, to be honest, they've been really ugh, stressful and, you know, fair enough we had just finished off our assessment and we just basically going to come in and do an oral which was on the Monday but that got cancelled uh, the thing is we also just jumped straight into third term work which to me I think is kind of a wrong time to do I know it's getting a head start but still you can see from most of us it is a bit tiring of what we did with the assessment and how we could have done something a bit more different to wind down for this term but they thought straight away, boom, next thing. It's like, wow. So, fair enough. I apologise again for shunning, uh, whatever the word's called, given this much negative in a way. Uh, you know, but as well as that, it, this week with the negativity, it kind of affected not only my friends but my family, so I apologise to them as well. So. Now that I've just done this essay, which fair enough, it's not, I don't think it's enough words, but it's the best that I could do. Um, now I feel a bit more, the only thing that's bugging me a little bit is money-wise. But I know, not to worry about that right now, just when it comes to that problem, it'll come to that problem when it does. So right now, just enjoy today, because today's Ice Cream Friday, <laughs> and uh, we're just going to enjoy. Oh, by the way, uh, to get an update as well on my American trip, uh, Americana trip to say, more probably, um, yeah, I've been given uh, what's called, the information I needed on where my final destination is, where I would be landing, and it's in Syracuse. Fair enough. So I'm also there, so I have to go and find flight prices and yeah, just basically price them up. But yeah, Syracuse, happy. Sean, you are not selling your body again. <laughs> Who are you trying to sell it to this time? Oh, it's you. Fair enough. Hi. Yes, please. <sighs> He's awesome! He's pretty brilliant stuff. Big house for Tom! Anyway, in the car. That'd be nice to me about the entire term. Okay. Oh. It was bloody warm in that car. I was basically That's because sweating I was in the car, wax. my darling. Because <laughs> <laughs> I was in the car. Uh, it was nice enough to give us a lift. Come here. You get hugged. You get hugged. I get man hugged. Oh. Oh. I better get a, I think I'm gonna get a rage hug from Sophie later. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, oh, yes. Oh, I love you! Is she there? Nope. Oh. Is no one there? Yeah, you are there. Ah, oh, there's no one from our. Oh. Yeah. Hi! Hi! Anyway, you guys gonna drop off the essays? Yes. I will. Uh, we gotta get him. I'm going to. I, I will stop. Let's go. We need to take him. Stopping. We need I to have... take him to the library so he can get up his week. I've already done everything, so I'm a good boy. Same. Although you heard earlier, right? You did it last night. Tom wishes to have the hug of the rage. Oh Christ! This. <laughs> That was a romantic moment.
Hold on. Hi! Oh god. Did we just finish our lesson? We just finished our lesson for Friday! Nah. And what's the traditional Friday? Ice cream Friday! Ice cream! But I have to be a responsible adult and drive and then go shopping for dinner. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> so it was be responsible. Well, maybe because I live at home, I have a car, um, I have money to actually get stuff with, so. So do I. Can you drive a car? Mm -hmm. Are you legally allowed to drive a car? Do you want to see my license? Do you have, do you have a car to drive? Now that's the question. Then obviously no, I the win. <laughs> you're just a perverted old grandpa. Who am I? I then. You're the, um, the guy with breasts. You're boob man. Yeah, I don't really want that boob going out on man. <laughs> He's boob man. Title. Growing boobs. <laughs> He's Boob Man Goat Man! Away! <laughs> wait, 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 wait! To the Boob Mobile! <laughs> 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 I'm like, too impressed going, dilly dilly! <laughs> well, I know where I'll be, I didn't know over the weekend. <laughs> nom 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 nom. Nom nom? Is it a nom nom? Is it nom nom? Nom 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 nom. Damn HMV cars. So cars, Kate, that I'm looking at uh, the Hunger Games. I'm not looking at the actual novel. I'm looking at the pictures from the movie. And it looks so awesome. I want to go and see it. And then Sean came over and was like, hey, look at this. And what well, did I didn't say look at this. What, what I did was I picked it up, yeah. put it on myself. I was like, oh, that looks good. Yeah. Realized, and then I put it, they realised what it was. And, oh. Wizard. Jamie, look. And it was um, what Kate has, which is a necklace of the mockingbird with the better, arrow but it was a it was a pin it was a badge and i thought i've already got like the one of uh, r2d2 and c3po and the gold heart on my lapel i saw that one i thought that would look really cool on my coat and it was 10 pound and i'm thinking oh you biscuit yeah i was half tempted to throw the table over i was really, really, yeah i was i was really half tempted I'm but, all right hello People are just saying hi to us, and it's like, no, hi to me, not you. Well, they know me as well. <laughs> Ish. I spent lots of time with them okay. when I had my depressive state in year term one. Okay. <laughs> sure, where are we going now? Well, we need to get a drink and then another look in Toys R Us. And I don't know. Who knows? Yeah, you know that machine that uh, swallowed the money and uh, wouldn't give us our text and stuff? They fixed the machine. Oh. You are so into that now aren't you for that much <laughs> yeah on it's the train and snap. walk it down yeah uh what you call it uh i looked at i was checking through my bag and i had the books of scott pilgrim volumes one and two <laughs> and i was like oh pass me uh, volume one then so he's been reading that now from the train ride home and it's like he's so into it oh by the way guess where we are now nice that looks dark. Hi again. Yeah, uh, my day at work. No, sorry, that was Chris. Then. Sorry. You don't want to hear that, just in case. Uh, but yeah, um, they go for more. Not again. No, he's been playing Old Republic again. As uh, who are you playing as? I'm playing as my new character that I will be playing as on the um, new show, um, uh, Wolf and Foxing. Yeah. Um, uh, I thought I'd just try it out, see what it looks like, uh, the missions wise, so I've got a little heads up of what I know. Hunger Games! Sorry, Hunger Games on um, the TV. Um, yeah, so yeah, I thought I'd just try that out for a bit. Yeah, as well as that, uh, i got to go, well, i got to make a picture of him as his modeled character, so he gets the picture for from Nicole. Hopefully that will work out well, and then we'll go from there. So yeah. And I'm hungry. <laughs> you know, he's not laughing at that. It's just what I'm looking at, babe. It's what I'm looking at, fail vlog. Uh, there's a picture on there. I'll try and get it on the link, but I'll show you the picture now. It's a first fail nation, first attempt at cooking fail. It starts off with how in the... And then it goes down to... Oh. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god! Thing is, I'm trying to do this as well. It's not I'm nice. trying to hit that. Wizard! Blade. 
Language? Oh, that's a nice tattoo. That is a cool t <laughs> He barely gets there to see you. <laughs> I'm fine. <laughs> oh, this is true. This is true. You know when you get no signal on your phone, do you do that thing? This is basically, you go all Lion King on it. <laughs> Oh, I'm just gonna get in trouble with Disney for that. Sorry, uh, all I know, I'm just getting in again. Oh my god, it was freezing outside. So, um, yeah, it's like officially Saturday because it is now 10 to 1 in the morning. But here's the thing, I couldn't go to sleep yet because I was checking out my Facebook and everyone was talking about, uh, the last episode of Clone Wars for Season 4, which, unfortunately, I couldn't watch because... It's not in the UK yet, which was totally gotten because everyone's talking about this whole Darth Maul against Obi-Wan rematch. And I thought, oh my god. But, you know, James Arnold Taylor, who voices so well as Obi-Wan Kenobi, sorry, um, <laughs> he was on EW asking questions, that type of thing. And I was going to ask him uh, one of my questions about voice acting, but unfortunately it didn't get answered. So I... I tried again and asking him on his Facebook page and uh, I asked him now, you know, what's the best way to go into a voice acting career and everything like that and telling him, he, you know, he's an inspiration for me to get into voice acting. And I didn't think now he would actually reply back so quickly, but he did. And this was like three minutes ago. He says, uh, this is his actual words now. Um, Thank you for your kind words, Jamie. I would say to keep studying and maybe get involved in radio or find some work in an ad agency or a video game company to get your feet wet in the voiceover community. Best of luck to you and God bless. Keep me posted, J-A-T. That was James Arnold Taylor, you know, giving me such, you know, good advice there. And this is why I go into voice acting. It's because of people like him now. The work is... Brilliant. I would watch, sad enough though, I would watch behind the scenes of what happens with the voices and stuff of Old, old Republic, no, 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 of Clone Wars, and I see, this is sheer awesome. Yeah, I could see myself doing it, and I meant, with stuff like that, and yeah, today, uh, my cradle came today, but it, uh, you know, had a, what do you call it, attempted delivery note came through, and I was like, oh. so I have to pick it up tomorrow. Uh, you know, this will get me inspired to do voice acting more and more and more. But, again, James Arnold Taylor, thank you ever so much for best advice like that. That is totally awesome. <laughs> I'm so happy for that. Anyway, uh, I'm going to go to bed because I'm up early in the morning. Because I have to go over to Swansea early to hang out with Sean for a bit. And then we're going to come back over here and get some ideas going for mini movies. And then hopefully then, just keep going with that then, but anyway, uh, I'm going to head off to bed, so I will see you guys in the morning. So until then, good night. Uh, for those who watched the season finale of Clone Wars, season 4, and uh, also to J.A.T., who highly doubt he'd be watching this, but still, I'll stick it out there. For you guys, may the force be with you, and good night. Take care, guys. Jamie's blog. Jamie's blog. Jamie's blog. Jamie's blog. Jamie's blog.